Let's look at this inequality one last time for the third time. We said in the last video, when we graph the solution, that the key x's are negative 1, 2, and negative 4, because those numbers make these terms 0. And now let's use test points to figure out the same solution. So we want to pick a number on either side and in between those key numbers. So negative 4, negative 1, and 2. Um, 0, of course, is here, but it doesn't really matter. So we want to pick a number like negative 5, negative 3, 0 would be good, and 3. So we don't have to worry about those key numbers now. If I plug in a number such as these into this expression, do I get negative or positive? Well, let's see. Negative 5. We've got a negative at the front. That becomes negative. That becomes negative. And that becomes negative. So that would give me overall positive. I don't want positive. So that's not part of the solution. Negative 3. We've got a negative in front. That would be a negative. That would be a negative. That would be positive. So that gives me a negative. That's what I want. So from negative 4 to negative 1, as we've said before, negative 1 is part of the solution. Now if I pick 0, I get pos positive, negative, positive. That's going to give me a positive, and I don't want that either. It's got to be negative or 0. So finally, if I do x equals 3, I get the negative at the front. That's positive, that's positive, and that's positive. So all together, that gives me a negative. That's what I want. So x is greater than or equal to 2. So of course, we get the same solution. That's the third way of doing it. Take your pick. I don't really like this method because somehow it seems to me like you're not really calculating it algebraically, but it's up to you. Okay, before we finish, today's anagram, election results. Have you figured out the answer? Maybe I can help you out a little bit here. Lies, and then let's, and finally recount. Are there a lot of, is there a lot of cheating going on in elections? Quite possibly, in one way or the other. We'll never know the whole truth. But be vigilant. Make sure that your elections are fair and free. See you next time for some more inequalities.